In this video, I'm going to show you how to take any font and turn it into outlines using Photoshop. Let's go. So before we get started, if you're looking for more tips, tricks, hacks, tutorials, and other design inspiration videos, then make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. And also don't forget to click that notification bell to get notified every time that I post a new video. So I've seen quite a few tutorials online of how to create outline text in Photoshop. The problem was a lot of those tutorials meant you had to rasterize your layers, meaning you couldn't go back later on and edit them. So in this video, I'm gonna fix that and show you how to create outline text that's entirely editable and you can go back anytime you like, change the color, change the font, change the, the stroke of the outline. You can do anything you like in retrospect. I'm gonna do that right now. So the first thing I've done is got Photoshop open and I've created an artboard which is 3840 by 4800. This works for any size artboard and pretty much any version of Photoshop. So go ahead and just open up Photoshop, create the normal artboard you're used to using and working with and we'll get started. So the first thing we're gonna do is get our text in place. And so what you're gonna do is hit T on the keyboard, bring up the text tool, and then you're gonna just click anywhere on the artboard to bring up the text. Then I'm just gonna use the word test. Just resize that. You can use obviously whatever message you want, any font you like. Uh, they all work so I'm just gonna go with test for now so you can see how this works so now that we've done that this is the next part we're gonna double click on the layer down here this text layer that says test or whatever your message is double click on that layer and it's gonna bring up the layer style panel then you're gonna go down to where it says stroke so click on stroke and you can see it got a little bit thicker just then but we've still got the inside of the text there so it won't show the full effect I'll show you how to get rid of that middle part of the text in a second so once we've added stroke, you can go ahead and change the size of the stroke. I'm gonna keep it at six pixels for now. You can choose the position. I would always recommend keeping it on the outside. That keeps the shape of the font nicely. Uh, you blend mode, go for normal. Opacity, go for 100%. And then color, just go for black. So that's just to get us started. So click OK. And now the effect really comes into play when we remove the fill. And we're gonna do that by going up to this fill panel here and just hovering over the fill until it brings up those two arrows pointing in opposite directions. And we're just gonna drag that to zero. And then there you go. Already, that is our text with the outlines, but no fill. So now we can go back to the stroke settings and we can adjust this to look how we want it to look. So I can make this like 10 pixels. I can uh, either choose it to be on the inside, the center, I, like I said, keep it on the outside, but you can, you can mix it up. You can change the color of it here as well, which is kind of nice. So if you wanna do like a colored stroke, you can do that too. Um, and also another thing you can do if you like, if you wanna make a bit more of a rustic effect, you can turn the blend mode to dissolve and then just bring that down slightly and it kinda of looks like it's been like drawn on with a pencil or something. That's just a little hack there. But we're gonna stick it uh, in back to black and we're gonna keep it at 100% opacity and normal. And so you can see if I change the color of the background now, we'll just choose a color here you will see that the color of the background changes and you can see straight through the text. So this works really well if you've got an image in the background or you've got uh, like a pattern or something, you can have this stroke uh, outline there and you can see the pattern through the text as well. So it's a really cool effect and really, really easy. So you can see that we can go in and edit this text. It's not rasterized. We can change the font if we want. Like we can do everything we want to it, just like a normal font, but it's just now just the outlines. So there it is. It really is that simple to turn text into outlines in Photoshop. If you design something using this tutorial, then please tag me on Instagram at designbyruben. I'd love to see what you guys create. If you've enjoyed this video, then make sure you leave a like. It really does go a long way to helping this channel and consider subscribing for plenty more videos like this to come. As always, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you again soon.